Hello everyone, I am back with a new video. Today's video is about Aufbau's principle and why this Aufbau principle is important to write any electronic configuration that we will discuss in this topic. This is Nisha Chauhan and you are watching Learn with Fun. If you have not subscribed this channel, please subscribe for more videos that makes your learning easy. So this is Aufbau principle and what is the meaning of Aufbau? Aufbau it's a German word, it's not a name of any scientist and the meaning of that Aufbau is to construct or to build. Build karna, construct karna, orbitals ko banana. So, in ground state, lower energy electrons fills atomic orbitals of the lowest energy level before occupying high energy level. This sentence ki meaning hai, electrons filling kaise hogi, lowest energy mein electron pehle fill hoga, baad mein higher energy level par jayega. Ab aapko kaise pata chalega ki kis orbital ki energy kam hai aur kis orbital ki energy zada hai. To usko pata karne ke liye, abbo principle ne ek rule use kiya tha, n plus l. And us rule mein n stands for principal quantum number and l stand for azimuthal quantum number or n plus l directly proportional hota tha energy ka it means n plus l ki value jis bhi orbital ki zyada hogi uski energy zyada hogi to uske according electron filling hogi suppose example 1s and 2s let's this 1 and 2 means number of n number of n number of principal quantum number and s ki value nikalne ke liye i will write here sp d F and this is L value of L. 1, 2, 3. So this is the value of L. Let's put this value here. 1 plus S key value is 0. Kitna ho gaya? 1, 2 plus S key value again 0, 2. Ab isse hume show ho raha hai ki value n plus L ki kis ki zada hai? Is ki. It means is ki energy zada hai aur is ki kam hai. To electron pehle kam energy orbital mein jayega, uske baad high energy orbital mein jayega, ye, ye show karta hai. Kabhi kabhi aisa bhi hota hai, jab dono ki energy same hoti hai, us time hum kaise pata karenge ki kaun se orbital ki energy zada hai. Us time ek hi rule ho sakta hai, jab usma n hum dekhe n, agar n zada hoga, to n ki value zada hogi, to us orbital ki energy zada hogi. So chalo ab hum dekhte hai kaise electron 1s. 2s, 2p, 3s, 3p, 4s, 3d. Let's take here. n plus l ki value nikalenge. Yaha par 1, 1 hi rahega. Plus s ki value 0. Value hai 1, 2. Plus s ki value 0. Value is 2. 2 plus p ki value 1. Value is 3. 3 plus s ki value 0. 3. 3 plus p ki value 1. So this 4. 4 plus s. Again 4. 3 plus d ki value is 2 and the value 5. Let's arrange this orbitals in increasing order. So increasing energy level Increasing energy level. Subse energy kam konse orbital ki dikri hai? 1 ki. So hum pele 1. After that 2. 2 aega. Right? 2 ki baan 3. Ab 3, 2 times 3 dikri hai aapko. To aap kaise pata laga hoge ki konse orbital ki energy zada hai? Usko pata laga ne ke liye maine aapse abhi kaha tha ki jiska n bada hoga uski energy zada. Jiska n bada uski energy zada. To in dono orbitals mein se bata hai n kiska bada hai? 3s ka. To 3s zada ho gaya. To 3s ki energy zada ho gaya. तो हम राइट करेंगे 2p की कम 3s की ज्यादा तो वो बाद में आएगा अब 3s के बाद कौन सा ऑर्बिटल आएगा दोनों की एनर्जी 4 4 है आंसर 4 4 है तो अब बताइए अब किसका 4 बड़ा है इसका 4 बड़ा है इसका 4 बड़ा है 4s का 4 बड़ा है इट मींस इसकी एनर्जी ज्यादा है तो इसकी एनर्जी कम है तो ये यहां पर आएगा ये 4s होगा एंड देन 5 लास्ट so this is the orbital according to the increasing energy level. So I hope you all have understood this method to write electronic configuration of any element. So in my next video, I will be sharing a trick to write electronic configuration with the help of above principle. So if you like this video, please share and subscribe this channel. Thank you.